Hey guys, it's Courtney, aka Travel Teach, here today to talk to you about starting out starter lessons. So I know a lot of teachers recently have been asking me how to prolong the lesson, how to make it fit within that 25 minutes, especially when you only have, you know, 17 or 18 slides. I want to show you some real examples of what I do with my starter students and how I get them talking. The main things I want to focus on are asking them about their day, about their school life, about their favorite things. So talking about your day, talking about your school life, talking about your favorite things. Most of our starter students, at least the ones that I have, are anywhere between three and seven or eight years old. So these students, their normal capacity for talking and for even speaking in Chinese and their native language is probably going to be generally about these things, about what did they do in the day, how is their school, what's it like, who are their friends, etc., and also their favorite things. In talking about their favorite things, I would pay special attention to their favorite color, their favorite shape, their favorite animal, their favorite superhero, etc. Today I'm going to show you a couple of examples about how you can start out the starter lessons and really show you the connection that I have with my students and how that first five minutes or even sometimes seven minutes can pass very quickly and you can get to know about your students and feel the connection between them. Okay guys, if you're ready, here we go. Peter, how are you? Today, do you feel happy, sad, angry, excited, or sleepy? How do you feel today? Sleepy. Sleepy. <sighs> Oh, oh, oh my goodness, so sleepy. <laughs> Peter, did you have a good day today? Did you have a good day or a bad day? Good day. A good day. Good day, good day, good day, good day, good day. What are you going to eat for dinner? No. Soup. Soup. Yummy. What kind of soup? Are there vegetables inside or noodles or? No. no? What's inside the soup? Egg. Egg. Oh, do you like egg soup? Um, yes. Yes. Good sunshine. Did you go to school today? Yes. Did you have a good day at school? Yes. Yes. Which class was your favorite today? What class is your Drawing? Did you have art class today? Yes. Yes. What did you draw in art class today? What did you draw? Heart. You drew a heart. Very good. What color was your heart? Pink. Yeah, today we're going to talk about unit number... It's number six. It's number three. Lesson number... It's number... <laughs> number... What number is this? Number eight. Number eight. Sophia, did you know that 
Eight is my favorite number. It's noon. What's your favorite number? It's noon. Do you have a favorite number? Yes. What number is it? It's eight. Your favorite number is number eight, too? No. No? What number do you like, Sophia? I like two. You like number two. I like number two, too. And the baby fairy has to her bed. The baby fairy has her own bed. Okay. She's so cute. And mommy fairy. Lucia, what is baby fairy's name? Chocolulu. Her name is Chonkululu? <laughs> What's yes. mommy fairy's name? Shishka. Shishka. Eh. Eh. Shishka. Is that mommy's name? Yes. Or is no, it's Shaska. Sister. Oh, okay. Wow. Lucia, they're so beautiful. <laughs> oh, did she wake up? <laughs> wow, Lucia, I really like your fairies. They are so beautiful. Lucia, do you want me to show you your sticker chart? Yes. Look. Let's take a look. I don't think. Oh, yes, now you I got. It. Okay. Do you see the fairy here? Singapore. You live in Singapore. Wow. How is the weather in Singapore? Always raining. Always raining? Can, yeah. you, can you play outside? No, I can't play. Can you play inside? Yes. Yes. What do you like to play with? With my friends. You like to play with your friends? Yes. Yeah. How many friends do you have? Is it in school? Sorry? Is it in school, I said? It could be in school. It could be out of school. You can tell me all of the friends you have. I don't know. Um... Um... Uh, in school, how many friends do you have? School has so many friends, but I cannot count. You cannot count. Wow, Melody, you're very lucky to have so many friends. Okay, guys, I hope that those little tidbits of video have shown you how you can have real connections with your students and what kind of questions you can ask, how you can keep the conversation going during that warm up or starter time. So if you liked this video, please give me a like. If you have any suggestions or other comments about things that you do in your lessons that really work for starters and for warm up, please leave me a comment down below and don't forget to subscribe for more great content. 
Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye.